Good morning, Patriots. Welcome back to Rex Pines TV. I'm Giselle Adams. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today is Wednesday, November 8th, 2023. Now let's go to Catherine for Today in History. Thank you, Giselle. Hey, Patriots. Today in History, November 8th, 1895, x-rays were first discovered. X-rays take pictures of bones and tissues so doctors can see if something's wrong inside your body. It was discovered by Dr. Wilhelm Rotigen. Fun fact, he actually did this by accident. He was testing rays on glass and accidentally discovered x-rays. X-rays are now used worldwide and are very important in human technology. Have you ever seen an x-ray? Now let's go to Camila for today's lunch. Thank you, Catherine. Today's lunch is chicken patty sandwich, turkey and cheese wrap, steamed corn, fresh broccoli, garden side salad, buttermilk ranch dressing, pineapple tidbits, and your choice of milk. And tomorrow's breakfast is whole grain donut ring, raisin bran, graham crackers, fresh apple, and 100% orange juice. Students, Please keep in mind that the lunch menu can change at any time and to always bring your lunch card. And don't forget to let your teachers know if you were receiving lunch today. Bon appetit. Now let's head back to Giselle. Thank you, Camilo. That sounds good. Tomorrow, grades 7th and 8th will be able to have their turn at the Patriots store. Be there between 7.15 and 7.55 a.m. Patriots, keep your phone shut down and in your backpacks at all times. And there is no chewing gum in school. Please throw it out before entering the building. Scholars, great news. The breakfast party is finally here. Get ready. It's going on today and tomorrow. Hope you have a great time. Wait for the announcements in order to go. The breakfast is going to be wonderful. Friday is no school. Remind your parents that it's a free day. Enjoy your extra long weekend. Don't forget to bring two cans. If your class brings enough cans, not only will you get a popsicle party, but also, someone out there will receive their dinner. You have this week to donate. Good luck! We're having family night at Jollibee next week Wednesday. So much fun. Will you show up to this party? Boys and girls, K-5th through fifth grade, registrations are reopened and the coaches are accepting new interested students for the Indoor Soccer League. It will start this Saturday, November 11th to December 9th. The fee to register is $100. Please see Coach Lee to sign up. Now let's shine on tomorrow for today's weather. Hey Patriots, today's weather is 84 degrees Fahrenheit with partly cloudy skies. It's not a good day to take a swim. Talking about swimming, scientists have discovered a new coral reef near the Galapagos Island. This reef is over 1,000 feet under the island and 26,000 feet long, which is the size of 19 football fields. In this reef, there are so many crustaceans, anemones, and sea urchins. Scientists say the reason why the reef has color is because it has been undisturbed for thousands of years. Galapagos Island was founded on March 10, 1535. Now 470 years later, we found beautifully ocean life. Ariel would love to swim there. Now let's go to Eliya for today's birthdays. Thank you, Samara. Today's birthday boys and girls are Adrian Rodriguez, Danielle Adarensola, Marjoshi Baloney, with Sharon June, and our belated birthdays are Vladimir Cadet, Aaron Gandica, Faith Ortega, and Fabian Gonzalez. Happy birthday! Now let's go back to Giselle. Thank you, Aliyah. Patriots, here are your past expectations. It represents present yourself positively, act kindly towards others, treat the school's environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. Congrats to Ms. Gray, Ms. Arnold, Ms. Danqua, Ms. Sohn, Ms. Merkel, Ms. Jordan, Ms. Reddick, and Ms. Mirage for getting the correct answer to yesterday's challenge, which was, what mammal can't jump? The correct answer was elephant. Today's daily challenge is... Daily Challenge! In 1990, a person was 15 years old. In 1995, that same person was 10 years old. How can this be? Teachers, please send your answers to pines.renaissance at gmail.com before 9 a.m. in order for your answers to be reviewed. Winners will be announced on the next morning announcement. Everyone at RBTV would like to wish you all a wonderful Wednesday. Have a fantastic day!